Just, you know, everybody coming together. I mean, it should have been done a long time ago in my eyes. Every time, you know, we real come through, we always show them love, kid frost, whatever, you know what I mean? Whatever. We always, you know what I'm saying, like to show love. And it's just like, we Latino, you know what I mean? And we like, to me, I feel like we all like very spirit, spiritual, no matter if you're Mexican, Puerto Rican, Cuban, Colombian, whatever you are. You know what I mean? So I think like we got something that's like real different from everybody else. You know what I mean? We always stick together. So it's about time we get this. And hopefully we keep getting together in the future, man, to show each other love. Because it ain't no difference whether you're from the east or the west coast or whatever. You know what I mean? We Latino, you know what I mean? We get down, we cut across all that day shallow. I think it's a historical moment, man. You know? The whole unification thing, you know, bringing East and West and the Latin, all different Latin cultures, you know, Mexican, Cuban, Dominican, Puerto Ricans, you know, bringing it all together, man, it's historic. I think we're underappreciated, you know what I mean, this is the whole hip-hop scene and uh, I don't really acknowledge the work we've been putting in, you know what I mean, uh, you got people like Cypress, the Beat Nuts, Fat Joe, been around for a while, you know what I mean, and you hardly ever hear them or see their videos on whatever video, little Mickey Mouse video show, something like that, you know what I mean? So I think it's real important, you know, it just brings, out, brings us out there. That's why we're here, you know what I mean? And what, you know, we came out, it's like, we ain't pigeonholed, so we're coming out as a group. We came out like that, boom, mysterious, boom. Nobody didn't know, they gave them a chance to listen to the music with an open mind, instead of looking at us and going, oh, they're Latinos, and just brushing it off. He so which is incredible, you know what I mean? So, you can't come out saying, I'm like, you just gotta come out and do your shit. You don't rely on that for your gimmick. I think uh, if you're doing music and you ain't black, they're already looking at you a little weird, you know what I mean? But I think uh, there's a lot of Latinos and, and other nationalities right now making noise, you know what I mean? Well, you know, at first it was uh, Latinos and the brothers side by side making hip hop back in the 70s. I mean, if you look at all the older footage, that's all it was, was Latins and brothers doing it, you know what I mean? But the, the brothers hit it big with rap and it kind of pushed the Latinos in the background a little bit. So, you know, for a while, I guess that's why it seemed like we're the minority. And, and since then, just a few of us of Latin descent have made a big impression on um, the hip hop scene, and that, that's probably why we're the minority. It wasn't about whether you're black or, or, or Latino or whatever, it was just you have to be a dope MC. And if you rock the crowd, you rock the crowd. You know, if not, you were just straight up this, but not because you were uh, Puerto Rican or black or whatever. It's just, you know, boo, get off the stage, next. There's a lot of extra, I feel like there's a lot of extra boundaries and hurdles you have to overcome, you know what I'm saying, just to be taken seriously in the game, but that just means you got to put it down, you know, you know, better than the next cat, you know what I mean? You can't go out there with no racial rhymes and visual beats and, you know, try to come up like that, man. You take the hard route like we do, we take the hard route, take, take that ish, keep original beats and, you know what I mean, keep original rock ish, and not just try to spit real game. So everybody just, just come together, you know what I mean? Because uh, back home, you know what I mean, nobody's like that, you know what I mean? We're not even close enough. We don't even, I mean, we don't even chill together, you know what I mean? But out here, it's like, I don't know, I just think things like this, you know what I mean, need to happen more, you know what I mean? So we can get Latin people heads work together, you know what I mean? We're taking the rap belt, we're taking the titles, we're taking all that, you know, the awards, everything, you know what I'm saying? The Latinos, it's time that we shine because we've been down since day one. And I mean, rap is all over the world. It's just not America, you know what I'm saying? So you can't just say it's black anymore. You know, it's brown now, you know what I'm saying? And, you know, it's going to be all over the world. We're going to keep doing this forever. We're going to be here for a long time. So just put that in your head. I mean, it just goes to show you how, uh, how powerful, you know, the hip hop artists, you know, in general could be, whether it's Latin hip hop or, you know, black hip hop, Puerto Rican, you know, Dominican, whatever. It's all family out here. That's why we came out here, because one love, you know. The unity between the East and the West and the Latin influence that has often been uh, overlooked 
uh, from both sides and you know the contributions that, that we've made since uh, you know since we started doing this uh, hip-hop thing so we definitely got a lot of love for all the cats out here because they definitely influenced I mean me personally they influenced me to getting involved and wanting to, this to be a uh, you know, part of my career, you know what I'm saying? The Latins were instrumental in the beginnings of hip hop. If you if you uh, go back, a lot of the uh, MCs were Latino, either Puerto Rican, Dominican, whatnot. So uh, even though they might have looked black or whatever, they were Hispanic. And uh, they people call it like uh, an Afro-American, uh, you know, uh, music, but it's, it's more than that. And coming together like this and you see all the people, I think it's uh, it's a big thing. It's important because we've been here since day one. It's an obvious answer, you know what I'm saying? But um, you know, say it's beautiful. You know, there's more. There's even more than this right here. I'm just glad that we get this money together. You know what I mean? But it's important, especially because it's too cold on top of that. And we're showing we're not only showing Latino um, unity, we're showing East West Coast unity, which is important. You know what I'm saying? Because that's I, I can't see myself beefing with the West Coast, and then um, Cypress want to do a song with me. That's Latino first. That's more important than East West. That's familiar. That's that's that's, that's an outside. You know what I'm saying? So it all sounds pretty when you bring it down to that. Yo, yo, roll the dice, man. Roll the dice. Yeah. 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 Yeah.